Okay then, video number two. Uh, so let's get straight on with importing these image planes. Okay, so first thing you have to do is get your four view up. You can do that on a new screen by hitting spacebar, which will bring it up like that. If you can't find it, it's on your toolbar down here. Um, I just think it's the one just below this this singular view here, but I can't see it on my screen. Okay, and then what we're going to do is just import top into the top view, front into the front view, and side into the side view. Uh, and you'll also see them appear in here. So to do that, in your panel menu, you click on view, and then you'll see there's an option for image plane, and then import image. So because I'm doing the top one, as you can see there, it says top. I'm going to select, I know this is called bottom, but it is the top view as well, as you can see. Uh, click on open, and that's one down straight away. There you go. Beautiful. Uh, then we need to do the front, so it's the same process again. View, image plane, import image, and front. And then that just leaves side to do. Same again, view, image plane, import image, and side. Okay, they're all imported. Now, before we move on to the next video, where we're going to have to move these around, um, we need to learn a little bit about selecting these. They don't react like normal shapes do in Maya. If you just click on any of them, um, it won't necessarily let you select exactly what you want. It's very sort of temperamental. Same as in these views, it rarely lets you select them at all. Okay, the way to make sure that you can select them is to drag a selection just over the edge line of them. And that will, as you can see as they're going yellow now, that will always let you get what you want. And that should work in any view. There you go, so you can see I can now select them. That's important to know uh, for the next video where we're going to correct the position and make sure they're all perfectly lined up to the grid and each other. So I will see you for that in video number three.